I was probably... Oh, boy. Yeah, this is fun. Well, at least my speed's not low, so I can at least keep up. But, yeah, my attack is kind of not really there. Oh, shit. I'm off the stage. Go for this. Ooh, okay. So, yeah, feasibly, this isn't impossible, but it's still going to be a little pay of pain, Jake. Also, should not have done that. Oh, boy. Well, at least he's gonzo. Sort of. At least I'm regenerating. I think my attack's buffed. I don't think so. I'll take the all on that one. But yeah, the, the, the ridiculous thing about my tonic regeneration is that... Oh, my God. I didn't know Emma actually came out of that. Uh. It doesn't just regenerate red health. It regenerates all of your fucking health. And with, like, just like that, we're done here. <laughs> okay, maybe my tonic regeneration does also increase your attack stat. Because remember, I had no attack points going, or I had half the attack going into that. That was fucking nuts. That was crazy. Also, remember, here's them being a lot trickier than that to fight. I don't know. I think beforehand I was leaning off with Shizu Knight, and Shizu Knight is not that good. Let's go. Yeah. I'm sorry, old man. <laughs> well, shit. Okay. Also, you're not really one to talk to, right? You're like 50 plus old, 50 years plus yourself. Anyway, so... <sighs> okay, I love how there's a fucking healing room behind a rock. So if you don't have enough abilities, you're not getting through that. That's a fucking prick move. My god. Remember, the first time you go through this, between every healing room, you are only able to access... Uh, the boulder smashing twice. Just two. And remember how many shortcuts I had to get through in order to get the ear. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, that is dickheaded level design right there. <coughs> In fact, I explicitly remember my first time through this game, I did have to go all the way down, activate it, and then go all the way back up. So that was like four fucking rounds right there. If not more. I don't remember if there's a fifth one or not. Asshole move, considering how dry it already is. Yeah. Also, I'm trying to wish you had the ability to throw people forward. That'd be nice. Instead of just only being able to uh, put them in corners, if, you're ba if your back is in the corner. I wouldn't mind, honestly. Jesus, we're almost intersecting that bird. Okay, can we not please? Also, I just realized I'm doing a fight of uh, cho Chakra Sapper, so this is kind of cool. Up circle? I didn't really go for the up circle. Holy fuck, that was a soccer kick. Not really a soccer kick, but okay. Oops. Come on. God, the trees. Bait him? Baited? Okay. <laughs> it's so funny that, right, looking back on it, I've never actually gotten that much use out of... Uh, palm rotation, but holy crap, is it still decent? Alright, not too bad. Not too bad. Okay, uh, yeah, we're still good. Go for another real room and see what we got. Also, holy fuck, I'm legitimately just 10 rooms out from the end of the game. Oh my god, okay. That is... <laughs> doing good. Doing very good. Also, I have to keep my phone on to make sure I don't get a sudden message from Conrad. Well, I got a notification. Oh, fuck. I was looking down. I didn't know it already started. The two-day exam preliminary is one of the attendant tomorrow if I come on. Oh, wow. That was uh, fifth, maybe? Okay, cool. <laughs> the fight that didn't exist in the manga. Which clan founded Hanley um, Uchiha? <laughs> it was not the Akimichi clan. And, frankly, the Hyugas never really do too much outside of their own affairs. So, you know, there's that. You know, there's still the whole, there, there's, um, how do I explain this? Remember back in the day how, um, people, the, the Hyuga clan always bragged about how they were the oldest clan in Hidden Leaf Village? When it was one of the, a, a member of the Uchiha clan literally helped found the Hidden Leaf Village? Does anyone else remember that? Am I, am I going crazy here? Because that little... That little plot hole never really got resolved. Then again, lol, I don't know how to kill Madara, so, you know, if there's that. Uh, Kishimoto is not the most consistent of writers, definitely, in case that wasn't obvious. 
The other game who's not necessarily rushing his, rushing his projects, unlike, you know, Tite Kubo, so whatever. Alright, next up. Uh, oh, hey, we only got one. Yeah, there's actually a lot of things lost in transition, or lost in translation from the beginning of the series to the end of the series. Like, the whole, you know, ninja aspect, but, you know, that's neither here nor there. Oh, we're doing it for doing this, hell yeah. <laughs> yep. I still feel like Lee could totally take on Neji. At the... After a certain point, you know, once the once the weights come off, considering Neji needed fucking Byakugan in order to follow his movements. Yeah, no, <laughs> definitely. All right. Oh fuck. Okay. At some point in the future, I should probably make a little video of the top ten biggest plot holes in Naruto. Which, yeah, that would take a while. That would definitely take a while. Like, the big one for me is how is Madara able to use Renegon without his Renegon? How is he able to use Renegon powers without the eyes as well as Susano without the eyes and, you know, so on and so forth. A few other things like the very shenanigans involving Obito's apparent revival and all that shit. I should, it's curious, I should probably put a hit out for user input or like I should probably reach out to my subscribers and ask them because that would be a very interesting thing to do like y actually user submitted I want yeah you know what? I'm gonna go through this sometime I'm gonna ask my subscribers you guys what you think the biggest plot holes in Naruto is that would actually be very interesting I gotta look into this anyway which is the following is the name of the woman on the Hindley village count Oh my god, you saw Koza Haru? I don't know! <laughs> okay, good. Jesus Christ, I don't know that! Which of these is the third of the eight gates? Okay, gate of life. Fuck, I pressed triangle by accident. Uh, I am losing it right now. What's the rate of failure for our first survival training taken by Ninja? About 76%? Really? Might have been 50% of them. Wait, why not? What was that question again? Rate of survival. For the first challenge. What the hell? Maybe I didn't read that right? Because that didn't really make a lick of sense. Um, I don't know. Strange. Anyway, so we're going up or down. We're going down. <laughs> of course. Okay, I've already used you. Uh, he not still has one use. Hell to the yes. <clears throat> Alright. Uh, riddle room, battles... You know what, actually, I'm very curious. Th these riddles, they're actually challenging me now, so I have to stay in there. I'm gonna keep going at the fucking riddles. Come on, Yuruka. Come on, Raiden. That hurt me. What is the first Okage used to call the third Okage? Uh, just Saru, I think. It's so weird. What? I thought that was it. Okay. What is the second Okage used to call third? Jesus fucking Christ. Okay. They call them two different things? Okay. When Naruto had become a Genin, what was the name of the cat he caught? Tora. I know that one for a fact. Tora. And the top one was Dora? Very nice. That had to have been on purpose. There, there's no way that's not a reference to the show Tora Dora. Because I know that's a fairly popular show. Or it was. I don't know what to say if that is. Anyway. Uh, dude, hit me more more those. I'm feeling this one. For some reason, my stutter and my slur somehow made riddles almost sound like immortals when I said that. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, I need to focus a little more. Who the following specializes in using ninja tools? Uh, easy. Damn, th these questions are getting pretty abstract. The two examples are preliminaries. Who was Kiwa's opponent? Uh, preliminaries. Naruto. That's not specific. That's You're changing the phrasing on me. Which village did Rishimaru found? Hidden Sound Village. Duh. Okay. <laughs> I have all of them right on that one. Okay. What's the name of the one of the people in Hidden Leaf Council? Give me a fucking break. Alright, let's get some more points. Hell yeah. I'm feeling this one. Wow, you, uh, you really gotta go away from that treasure room, huh? Uh, pfft, sure, why not? I've only used Itachi like once since I got him in here, so why not? Also, I buffed his fucking speed, so... Oh, Jesus Christ! Itachi... Kisami with buff speed, too! Oh, Jesus. This is gonna be terrible.
Wow, okay. <clears throat> what even is happening right now? This is just fucking insanity what's happening right here. God damn. Well, it's good to say that Ita or Kisami with speed buffs is a fucking nightmare. Holy hell. I mean, it doesn't make sense, you know. All the history he already has combined with the fucking uh, increased shit with, he would have with speed. Have to use this. It still is really funny that the only thing they really did to tweak up this Weak. attack is just put in the actual manga kill showing on uh models come on models portraits close enough <laughs> god this is terrifying what we're doing right now we are in the goddamn matrix oh now we're not in the matrix anymore probably need to get Taji better defense at some point okay got to move There we go. God, that that fight was. Yeah, that was like normal people watching the Matrix, like fucking Neo fighting Smith or something. That was insane. God, we might as well have been fighting on the roof of that area. Holy shit! Hey, no drama room. Let's see, what we got it this time. Dare I ask? More decadery? Probably. We're almost there. I hope so. God, Tsunade is not doing good. What's the matter, Tsunade? Well, I mean, considering what we went through. Nothing. Also, Nothing. not gonna lie, I think the guilt will be weighing far more on Tsunade, considering what she was going through. Tsunade looks shaken up. I don't blame her. I am too. Also, I love how Dry always has the presence of the mind to know when he's being shaken up by Why? stuff. <laughs> Why does that stick in my mind? Guilt, god damn. Anyway, now's not the time to think about it. Hmm. Shizune, come on. Right. <laughs> so we just pulled them over momentarily so we could reestablish the fact that they're feeling really guilty about that. I mean, I guess it makes sense, but I don't think that was necessary. Alright, sure. Hmm. Next up. Are you ready for clone class? Uh, maybe. <clears throat> Alright. First go. Oh my, okay. We're moving at a good rate. You think I have higher difficulties to start including more of these in here? Alright. Eh, boy. Okay. Again, I was kind of worried I lost it in the mix there. Holy shit. And lastly, how bad? Oh boy. Same area. Okay, good. Jesus. I really am glad I'm putting this uh, playthrough at 60 frames per second because if it was at 30, there's no way you guys would be able to follow that at all. Like, I'm always considering lowering the, the refresh rate on my TV back to 30 instead of 60 so I can see how much of a difference they make, but. I don't want to let go of the free ninja points, so no thank you. <laughs> Maybe not. Alright, Kisame again. Uh, I don't mind, sure. I mean, I'm liking a little bit of hit points, but not nearly enough to be, wor to be worried. Defense is high. Oh shit, okay, now I'm worried. Now I am a bit concerned, because... It, uh, Kisame with buff defense, that actually is a bit worrisome. Reminds me, I also gotta get around to using Kisame a lot more in Tyson 4 because holy shit, he's actually good in that game. As far as. Okay, so my own personal history with like Clash Ninja Revolution, I know he wasn't like fantastic in either Revolution 1 or 2, but Revolution 3, I hear he's fucking obnoxious because of the Water Clone Jutsu build he had. Or no, it was the. um, Yeah, it was that combined with how you could do Water Prison Jutsu. Yeah, that was kind of apparently pretty bullshit back in the day. Not nearly as bullshit as like Sasori or Kiba or uh, Hiroko, but still pretty bad. 
God, saying Hero got a lot again. I really gotta get back on reading fucking Chipun and Doubt. J Jesus. Actually, I'll openly admit, I've never read. I've never actively read Chipun all the way through. In fact, before I started doing Tyson, I never also read the original manga for Naruto. So that's fun. I started reading Nar the Naruto manga um, when the anime showed. Four Tales Naruto vs. Uh, Orochimaru, and that was when my friend Noah personally recommended I do it because the manga was way ahead of the anime, and the anime had really bad filler at the time, so yeah, I could have kind of took him up on that, because that was the smart way to do things, so yeah. Oh boy. I love the animation for this, so god damn. Alright. <laughs> Rip. Almost had me die with Itachi. Almost. Well, if the ultimate didn't kill him, then the sheer advantages. Jesus Christ, at 75 points. I'm not complaining. I am definitely not complaining about that. Holy crap. But yeah, no, huge shouts to Noah for getting me into actually reading manga instead of just sticking to the anime. God. Uh, I miss Noah. I gotta go track him down at some point. Okay. Uh, Riddle Room. Oh, uh, I didn't even wasn't paying attention. I just kind of dropped Riddle Room, so I was like, yeah, whatever. Let's see what crazy bullshit we have today. And the tuning example of memory is one of the Sar Sasuke Yari fight comp. First! Dead first! Oh my god, that was three seconds long. No wonder I got screwed up last time. Who of the following most recently became a Jonin? Fuck. Uh, Kur and I. Okay. She struck me as someone who just recently became one. Uh, when Naruto had become a Genie, what was the name of the cat he bought? God! Damn it! Okay, you can stop asking me that question. I know it's Tora. God. Oh, you answered. I expect nothing less of you. Ha 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 ha! Oh, fuck you, Eureka. You're giving me some really fucking dumb questions. Okay, not dumb, but God, they something that no one would, except a hardcore fan would know. Sure, to think what they would do if you. Oh God, can you imagine the Shippuden games asking you questions about the filler? Jesus Christ, there's no way anyone would get that. This seems like a fun fight. Yeah, let's do Gara. Why not? Seriously, though, could you imagine that? Be having a trivia questions put on you based on the Naruto filler. Holy hell. I started to think about that. Oh, okay. That, that was... That hit. Hmm. Okay, put him in a corner. On. Oh boy, this is. I will admit, using Gara against a high mobility character like Neji is not the easiest thing in the world. Oh, okay, I always made the hard made the hard read on that one. It's crazy just how many fucking Shukaku arms he's calling out now. God. There we go. Jesus. Okay, I got him to teleport. That's good. Let's see what else we can apply pressure with. Pop this. Did I get hit with speed, speed down just now, or is that a defense down? Couldn't really tell you. Well, oh my god, did that actually steal the chakra, or that knock items off? That knock items off. Oh god, it's gonna fuck him up. If he starts, tries to down the ground, he's gonna get hit, stunned by the, uh, the cow troth. If he tries to go in the air, he's gonna get fucking stopped by a sand shuriken. That's a dickhead zap if I've ever seen one before. That's a oh my wow okay. How long have you been able to do that? Cancel out uh, your physical attacks with projectiles. That's really dope actually. Holy hell. That's his fucking standing jab. God, <laughs> standing jab is wow. That that speed and range is terrifying. God damn. Okay. Gonna make absolutely certain that Conrad isn't trying to get a hold of me while I'm doing this because I don't want him to be locked out of the house or anything. That would suck. Alright, so next up, another battle room or another clone room? Uh battle rooms are fine. I'm not complaining too much. Four more four more rooms until the end of the game. Holy shit. And hmm. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> it's been a few rounds that I've used to not anyway. And now I'm struggling to come up with decent commentary for this, because 
God, this game has lasted way, well, not way longer than I expected, but it's been a lot more demanding than I've expected in order to stay invested in it. Oh, shit, I did not want to use that. Well, I don't know. I might still be able to actually do it. Woo! Oh, God, yeah, that's definitely an attack buff of some kind. Too bad for the siphoning chakra, but whatever. Alright. Knock him all the way to fucking next year. Next year, Jesus Christ. God, that was chip damage. Oh my god, I couldn't tell if that was chip damage or if he actually took that out of the face. If that was chip damage, that was a terrifying amount. God damn. <laughs> that gave me 41 points for it. Jesus Christ, okay.